While U.S.-backed organizations such as the World Bank have praised the major structural reforms pushed forward by Mexican President Enrique Peña Nieto, leftist parties, students, teachers, former farmers, and other worker unions have heavily criticized the new laws, causing them anti-popular. Many organizations have threatened with more protests against the reforms. Our correspondent Clayton Kahn is in Mexico with the latest. The beginning of the work week here in Mexico City has seen various protests by national farm work organizations rejecting the so-called structural reforms proposed by President Enrique Peña Nieto that they say is an attempt to further privatize communal lands and restrict further state support. The farm workers from more than a dozen states say that specifically the energy reform and its secondary legislation signed into law in August of this year represents a form to legally dispossess farmers from their land for energy exploitation and mining concessions. In the hydrocarbons law, energy companies have the priority of utilizing protected farmlands for energy extraction, forcing farmers to see control and ownership. There's also backdoor discussions that an agricultural reform is on the horizon. However, farm worker organizations say they have yet to be consulted by legislators on the content or intended benefits of the law that would be uh, implemented. And thanks to Clayton.